Uh, so I'm speaking at the Welcome Burrows Fund Symposium. Uh, so when we think about membrane protein biophysics, we mainly think about the protein part, but we forget that the surrounding membrane environment actually is not a mere passive bystander. It plays actually a critical active role in organization and function of the membrane proteins. So my lab focuses on developing next generation technologies to study membrane proteins in their native environment. And we apply these technologies to questions related to pancreatic cancer, psychiatric psychiatric disorders and pain perception. And these will be some of the topics that I'm going to talk about today. It's like opening up an analog watch uh, where you can see all these gears and the moving parts uh, that are kind of working together to keep precise time, right? Similarly, in cells, tissues, organs, organisms, whichever scale of biology one is interested in, there are moving parts, right? And this could be in cells like proteins, lipids, metabolites, uh, nucleic acids, and so on. It's only a million times more complex than an analog watch. So I think that the future of biophysics hinges on us observing these biological processes, right? Both at the part of the individual moving part level and how they operate together as a, a biological system. And I think this needs to be done with precise spatiotemporal and molecular resolution and in an ideal case scenario without perturbing the native environment in which these systems are operating from. I think we are living in the most exciting time to be a biophysicist and do biophysics. This is because with the technical advancements, both from an experimental and computational standpoint, we are now able to ask questions that were intractable even a decade ago. So I think that's lending wings to our imagination. It's making it happen. And I hope that with these newfound uh, insights and discoveries, we will be able to you know, help resolve like devastating clinical problems around the world. I think from my address, the attendees will take away that how important the native membrane environment, native lipids are for membrane protein function. Also, in general, from like looking at the titles of the other speakers in the symposium, there seems to be emerging common theme where uh, they're interrogating biophysical questions in close to native cellular environments. So I think we are moving towards closing the gap between what is in vitro biophysical studies and in cellular or in vivo investigations in the future.